Are you a home buyer and you've just gotten your home inspections all done and you saw some issues on it and you're wondering, what do I do now? Stay tuned. Welcome to Step Into The Valley with Katrina Du at the Three Step Realty Group. In today's episode, we're talking to you home buyers who have had your inspections done and you saw some issues on the inspections and how to handle those issues. Well, first of all, don't freak out. It's going to be okay. <laughs> My number one or first recommendation would be to ask your realtor to sit down with you and go over all the reports with you because he or she can usually help you break down what are the really big issues and what are the not so big issues. And the reason why I'm separating the two is because if you're in a position to ask for repairs from the seller, then it, I highly recommend, or it's highly recommended, you focus on the big issues and hold the small issues for later. Because sellers don't usually like it when they get a request for repairs for everything. So focus on the big ones. Now, how do you focus on the big ones? Well, first of all, if you had a roof report, look at that first and make sure that it doesn't say you need a whole new roof because that would be a really big issue. <laughs> and if it doesn't say you need a whole new roof, then evaluate the repairs that it does list on there, if any, and talk to your agent about which ones are possibly the more important ones to address. Now, next, you wanna look at your pest report. Pest reports are broken down into three categories, section one, section two, and recommendations, or unknown sometimes. Now, section one items are items that is are recommended to be taken care of within zero to three months of getting that inspection report done. Why? Because those are considered really big items some, most of the time. So for example, is there an active termite infestation in the home? Well, that's a big item. Is there a lot of wood rot or fungus damage that could eventually be termite food? That could be considered a big item. Evaluate those with your agent. And then of course, look at the home inspection report and look at all the health and safety issues. The things that I like to focus on first are the heating unit and the AC unit to see what the home inspector said about them. Are they heating to the level they should or cooling to the level they should? And then look at the electrical. Now you're gonna see a ton of stuff on the home inspection report, but these are the areas I like to focus first on because if I find big issues, it's usually in these categories. Now, if you're thinking about buying a home and you want an agent or a realtor to help you walk through this process, we would be more than honored to. Give us a call at the number below. And in the meantime, subscribe to our YouTube channel because every Friday we have a new video out for you.